how to plan my MBBS first year so efficiently that this much huge syllabus becomes only this much for me. So in this video, I am going to tell you about how I managed, how I planned and how I organized my first year of MBBS and which were the mistakes I incurred and which I want you should not. So let's start with the video. Welcome to Need to Doctor. This is Shruti Ahuja, MBBS student at GMC at Chandigarh. The primary concept which should be in your mind is that if the syllabus is of, for example, 10 chapters, 10 chapters in anatomy, then you have to just focus on one chapter at a time when you have made it a goal. What do I mean by that? For example, I am having chapter general anatomy and I have uh, made it a goal I have to cover in this week. In week one, I have to cover this. Then I will just focus on what do I have to study in this week and more precisely, I will focus on what do I have to study today. For example, I have to study today the skeletal system from general anatomy only. I will focus on that. I will watch its video. I will um, um, read its book. I will learn it, right? And I will ensure that I revise it also in future. But for now, I will focus on this much thing only. If I will see what is there in the upcoming chapters, for example, the upper limb, lower limb, head, neck and face, neural anatomy, such huge chapters, such a big workload for you. But if you will think I have to study everything and if you will think that I have to study everything from general anatomy and everything should be learned, should be in my head, like at this point of time only, that is not possible because these terms are very new to us. These terms are very difficult for us and we would not be able to grasp it so early as we are expecting to be as we were expecting to be in need right so it is not the same story right here so here you need to have some patience just keep on reading just inculcate some knowledge into yourself uh, daily and study consistently consistently doesn't mean that i will read one page daily and i will be done with the syllabus no for that you need to divide your syllabus in the year in the month, in the weeks, and then the day. So that is the overview, how you need to start with your uh, journey, how you need to start with your planning. So just keep this thing in mind that, that you have to focus on this point of time, not in the future topics, and not in that thing that why it is I'm not learning it, why I can't recall it. Try to recall, try to learn, but if you're unable, then Leave that thing, study something else, then come back to it again. This practice will help you a lot. I hope this video was uh, very helpful for you. And if you want to know the future tips related to this topic, then uh, do follow me, do subscribe the channel and um, to get regular updates, stay connected.